My name is Naive Libertarian Politics, and today I'm here to discuss the Joe Biden immigration policy and how it may positively and negatively affect the Democratic Party. So let's jump straight into it. According to USA Today, Joe Biden has announced that he will raise the refugee cap to 62,500 refugees, which is far larger, obviously, than the previous one. So uh, this will this will help. This will both help and uh, damage de- the. Uh, well, this will this will really only help the Democratic Party. Um, what will help hurt them? Will I'll get into that later. Uh, it'll help the Democratic Party because many will come. Uh, in, refugees will come in. They will come move to states, become c- citizens, or they will move to states with lax voting laws, which do exist. Uh, very very common states, a lot of states, um, and they will vote for people who let them in, of course. Um, this can really only positively affect because, um, because as in, uh, uh, you'll, you'll see when I get into the uh, reasons why it'll damage. The reasons, uh, the reason why, why it'll damage starts with a reason why it'll help, which is the uh, Joe Biden is, is lowering immigration limits for, um, for there, he's He's lowering immigration security so legal immigrants can come into the United States easier, which um, which helps him because they will like like refugees they will move to states with with uh, lax voting laws and they will vote for the people who let them in. It is uh, a simple fact, and that is one of really one of the most common. It's really the the mainest reason why establishment Democrats are doing this because they know they will get votes. From people, from the people who, who they let in. So this can help. This can help the Democratic Party because of that. But it can also hurt the Democratic Party because of what I'm about to show you. So this is a comment on my Senate predictions video by the President. It says A Z may go red because of the border crisis, which is a uh, it's a it's a true it's a true statement because um you know. Uh, contrary to popular belief, um, uh, people on the border don't like um, illegal immigrants crossing through their states for many reasons that I will not go into. I will not specify, um, but yeah, uh, this this could cause um, AZ to go farther red in in tandem with Mark Kelly's weird weird stances and weird. Uh, status in in politics as a moderate kind of, um, uh, and as well as it could be a red wave year, as seen in my previous video about the TX06 election. So you can see here that um, I have Arizona as a very close Republican state. It could go either way, but I am going to go ahead and say it's going to be similar to Nevada. Uh, the 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 lighter light light lighter um, red and also I'm going to say it could go lean but I'm going to say same color as Nevada um, now uh, it's not set in stone uh, this is just my opinion it's it's my name naive libertarian politics so I'm naive I'm not the most politically literate um, uh, this is more of a, uh, an update video similar to my last one. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed it. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, expect more videos to come in the future. And uh, like, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.